Uh, so we, we see a lot of growth in, uh, in Newfoundland. Uh, everyone is uh, ramping up their production. Uh, we think that 50,000 tons in Newfoundland is going to be within grasp, say, 2025. Uh, then marine harvest and uh, cooks have uh, ramped up and we will produce uh, 30,000 tons by then. So what are the biggest challenges right now for you in uh, getting operations up and running? Uh, it's basic uh, project risk. Uh, it's meeting all the deadlines. It is uh, funding everything and uh, not screwing up, basically. Uh, we, we just managed to bypass the last uh, hurdle, uh, which was, it was when we got the EIS approved, Environmental Impact Statement. Uh, we, we finished that within the fastest timeline that's ever been done in Newfoundland and we're very happy with that. We got also a, a response that it was a very proper one uh, and uh, it, it actually showed the government how much value we are bringing into the industry in Newfoundland. So what's your outlook then uh, say over the next three to five years for, uh, for the project? Uh, right now we are have started construction uh, of one of the largest uh, hatcheries in uh, in the world, and uh, that will the first phase of that will be completed during uh, late next year, early 2020, and uh, we are starting production in August, September, uh, and then the first first fish into sea is going in in 2020, and uh, we are harvesting the first fish in 2021. And from there we are scaling up, so the first production will be around 10,000 tons or 8,000. And, uh, and then we are, over the next five years, we are uh, incrementally reaching 30,000 tons.